There's always more to the picture. There's always more than what meets the eye. There's always more in front of us. We know that the happiest people amongst us are the ones who engage regularly in positive activities. So the happiest people taking this class are going to be the most productive and most effective, successful in their job. We want to make a difference. We want to know that we've contributed to the experience of other people around us. Or we've made life better somehow. We all need to feel competent or a sense of mastery at something. We all ideally need to feel a sense of choice and freedom in our goals, actions and our lives. And we all need a sense of connection to others, to give and to receive love. I know we both like to say that problems scream at us. We know when we have a problem. Whereas opportunities just whisper. So we often miss the whispers in our life and the beautiful moments. And we really need to focus more on those opportunities. And the whole point is, positive energy is a set of behaviors. It's not personality, it's not charisma, it's not attractiveness, it's a set of behaviors anybody and everybody can develop. We are social animals and we derive great joy from relationships. In fact, positive psychology research is showing that relationships are one of the main contributors to our psychological well-being. When people see you doing a heroic deed, it, it, it's like throwing a pebble in a pond. It influences other people to also do good things. If you have a high level of noticing and appreciating the positives in your life, of course you're going to be more satisfied with your life. It's a major predictor of life satisfaction. So it's a combination of one eventually changing our mindset, making sure we have all the positive attribution styles, etc., things that we need in our head. But it's also about an environment that draws out the best and inspires us to be our best selves. If we know that we have this potential for altruism and deep within there is this potential is present in us, then it's worth trying to encourage it. So we can think of meaning then as saying three different things. My life is worth it. My life makes sense. My life has a mission. In the words of Lao Tzu, when you realize that there's nothing lacking, the whole world belongs to you.